Let's talk about Cabo. Cabo. <laughs> Cabo is a card game by Bezier Games. If you're not familiar with Cabo, it's similar to golf, which is like an old classic card game mm -hmm. where everybody is trying to achieve the lowest score. Specifically in Cabo, everybody starts in with four cards face down. Yep. You're allowed to look at two of them, and then throughout the game, you're going to be drawing cards from the deck or exchanging your cards with cards from the discard pile. There are cards that allow you to peek at your other cards, that allow you to peek at other players' cards, and allow you to swap for their cards as well. The game ends when somebody calls Cabo, thinking that they have the lowest score in their hand. And if so, then they get zero points, everybody else gets whatever the sum is in front yeah, of them. Yeah, and all up. Just trying to get the lowest score possible. The game was originally released in 2010, and then it was brought back in 2019 with new artwork. So that's the version that we've been playing with. That's this one right here. Yeah. We love this game. Love. This game is probably our most played game of 2019. Ever. The game that we have played the most together. Oh yeah, it's probably ever. the game that we've yeah. played the most. Yeah. Ever. We'll play while we eat dinner, before we go to bed. So technically you're technically, supposed to yeah. play the game until somebody hits 100, cumulatively. Right. We'll make up our own rules. We'll typically do a best of five, and then once somebody has won, then the other person that lost is gonna be like... No, best it, of seven. Make it seven. Make yeah. it ten. Yeah. We love playing like really big, heavy strategy games, and we don't really care who wins usually, mm -hmm. but for some reason, this game is serious. And the reason why we love it is because it is such a meta game. It plays so well at two, it plays well at three. All player counts. At all player counts. The higher player count you go, the more luck is involved. Yeah, more randomness. So at two, we love it so much because it's just such a, an intense, quick meta game. There's a lot of meta game in it. Like I could pretend to like switch something that I think she's gonna think is garbage, so that way she could throw it away blindly, and then I can just pick it right back up. It's amazing. Love it. Yeah. <laughs> So, Bezier Games just published a new version, which is Cabo Deluxe. Look at that. And so what this version brings is now it comes with two decks. So you can either run two games or you can shuffle one deck, put it aside. And so in between games, it's much faster to play the next one. It also comes with a better score sheet. Look at that versus Cabo Deluxe. But the thing that I probably love the most is the box. This is the old box. We played it so much. Like, look at this box. Look how, look how torn apart that is. And it's also like really difficult to kind of open and get the cards out and then put it back. It was real strange, everything. the design of this box yeah. for a card game. I'm sure it was meant to like hang on like a- End cap? Store, yeah, an yeah. end cap or a store. So now with the new deluxe edition, it comes with a beautiful box that opens and closes so seamlessly. So we really love this game. No matter which version you check out, we highly recommend it. Have you played this game? And if so, what are your thoughts? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Bye.